All right, we're we're back at the end of the battle. If this is a new episode, hello. This is the Caffeine Coke Commentaries. I'm Six Seven Cyrus. This Welcome is Kudelka, back. and that's Blind Man's World. Hey, yeah. oh, it worked this time. Well, poopsicle. You cupcake. know what I think it is, and hmm. you'll probably agree with me. Uh, the Ram got overwhelmed. The uh, the Ram that's dedicated to the game. Yep. That makes sense. Something else was using part of what it tried to use. And when it couldn't use that bit of RAM, it failed to load the sequence. Took its toys and went home. Mm hmm. It here's makes sense save. to me. Yeah. Here's our yeah. save. Sweet. I'm just going to assume that this is the beginning of a new episode, either way, yeah. with that last one. I think that makes uh, sense. Oh. Sweet. Thank you for the tea, my dear. It's not tea, it's just boiling water. Well, it will be tea after <laughs> I put some leaves in it. I mean, without I you boiling the water, it would not become tea. I know, but yes. I'm just saying, that's not tea yet. You know yeah, what? Don't, don't drink it and expect tea, tea man. You're a smartass. Why can't you just let me do that? <sighs> Fine, you could be a smartass. You Thank win. Thank you. Steve, <laughs> the, Steve, the proper oh, response money. says, Thank you, Sam. I love you, sweetie. That's true. Uh, ben says that the, the only response that I should have had was, thank you, sweetie, I love you. <laughs> I think she agrees with your sentiment. Yes, thank you. No problem. <laughs> yeah, I'm a couple's counselor, so you there you go. There's your free session. Oh, we, we just got a free counseling session, too. You, you see what you've done? How is that my fault? <laughs> Definitely your fault. Oh, crap, we're going to need another session, though. <laughs> Th that's true. I didn't say you weren't, but in this case, I just don't understand why it was necessary. Because it was a joke. You told me I brought you tea when that's not what happened. That's not... That's okay, not okay, you have a point. So I I'm going to cool it on the, the black tea. I'm going to have some green tea, my good old cranberry pomegranate. Now, I could have spearmint green tea, but I get to a point where that, that fresh mint flavor is just... I don't know. My mouth feels like too much like clean or something. So. Yeah, spearmint. Ugh, I don't like spearmint very much. Oh no! I ripped the tea bag. It's a oh, bad dang. omen. Now it's gonna be Turkish tea with all the grounds on the bottom. Ah, oh, gross. Yeah, I know. It's pretty good though. If you just don't, you don't get those. Finish it. Yeah. Saddle. You have to be very gentle and very refined about how you drink it, and it's very good. Uh, it's, it's so weird that we're two minutes into this episode and I'm taking a break to make tea. I apologize, everyone. You deserve better, but... Everybody we... at home, make your own tea right now. Yeah. Go ahead. Just pause the video. Yeah. Boil some water with how, whatever method you want to do. And make some tea and join us for Caffeine Com Commentaries. It's Indeed. great. In yeah. fact, every episode, you should do that. Make coffee or tea. And drink along with us, unless you're allergic to it or your doctor says otherwise. Right, right. Uh, w what we're trying to do is kind of share an experience with you and part of that experience because it's the caffeine co-commentaries is the caffeine yes in yeah. whatever form you appreciate it you can have tea right. you can have coffee you, you can have uh pure lift uh which we'll talk more about that another time i'm just it's, it's a thing that you can do uh you can have like five hour energy uh That's true. you can do that there's so many ways you can just have coffee Coffee, tea, or me? I mean, yeah. Whoa! <laughs> you calm down, That's an sir. That's old saying. That's an old saying. Come on. Oh, okay. It rhymes. Um. So it's we've done this, and I don't understand what this is get ungated. What did it say? And that's um, okay. I accept you, even though you're gate. You know, you're gated. <laughs> so whatever, whatever that's uh, supposed to mean, you know. That's... It means until certain time uh, passes. <laughs> I'm not as strong as I am spiritually in the real world. Yeah, that's what that means. Okay, well, that's very good. All right. We love you, Stuff. <laughs> of course. Now, what does this say? It says... Sacred, sacred Light appears to have been purified by the holy water. Yeah, okay, that didn't help me. No, no I, don't, really. I don't want to save. What were we supposed to get from that? We did get a crown piece. Oh. So I wonder if that's going to take us through that puzzle that... Uh, the clock puzzle. Maybe. If the wait a puzzle's minute. just above that clock. We've oh, looked heaven. at the plant and we've gone to a blank screen. Aha! Oh, 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 oh. oh, oh. And Lambsbrick. And Michael Mayer. 
Cumulus Amphitheatrum Sapienti Eterni. Latin. What a collection of books. May I ask you something? What are all these? Ancient books on mysticism and alchemy. Ancient science. See, he's allowed to look at him, but no one else is. It's all about making gold from lead. It's just a ruse peddled by power-hungry tricksters blinded by greed. But in amongst the trash, there are some valuable works illustrating basic useful experiments for predicting the laws of nature. <laughs> predicting a time when all men will be treated equally. Never. God's will. No room I wish. Nowadays. James. Hermeticism. You... Kabbalah. Meaningless. Why? Why is it not here? What? Where else can it be? Are you looking for something? I don't understand. I don't understand. You don't understand. I don't understand. What are you grumbling about? You're acting really strange. Just cut the charade and tell us what's going on. I do not like this. We all have our reasons. Let's not delve into each other's personal affairs. I am not bound to please thee with my answers. Do all Whoa. men kill the things they do not love? Hate any man the thing he would not kill? And I thought all outlaws read just simple, stupid poets. You read Shakespeare. <laughs> You're smarter than you look. That makes two of us. <laughs> okay, that... For all the garbage about um, alchemy and man being treated equally, it's never going to happen, by the way. I, I said Shit. never in that process because there's just no way. Those who have power will use power against those they perceive to have no power. That is the human way. Yep. Even in space! Oh, uh, scientists are making um, Asgardia, apparently, uh, a nation in space. Really? And they want everyone to join them, and I'm just like, yeah, I'd like to do that, but this nation in space, are you going to set up the rules for humans in space? Because if you are, I don't want rules for in space. Uh, yeah. It's too new to, to make rules and laws. What you need to do is let it be like the Old West and be crazy for a while to keep people yeah. who are weak out of it until we make it better for everyone. Yeah, pretty much, like the frontier lands. Mm -hmm. You know exactly what I, I mean, then. Well, and in 2020, we're at, well, we, I use lightly, SpaceX is going to Mars for the Mars mission. Yep. So and those are pretty strong, smart people. Uh, going I'm, there and coming back, so hopefully. I'm actually terrified of what that means for humanity, because if mm. it fails, how are people going to act? How are they going to react? That would They'll be, just shut it down. That would be the biggest failure of humanity. Yeah. It'd be up there, that's for sure. Uh, letting Hitler rise to power. Now that's a failure yeah, of humanity. I, that's, that's what came to my head, too. It's like the Holocaust was a pretty big, badass failure yeah. of humanity. Um, the, the genocides in Rwanda between the Hutu and the Tutsis. So mm -hmm. That's a big-ass failure of humanity. Mm -hmm. But, yeah, uh, it would suck. It would it would close down our space program for probably a generation or two, kind of like when the shuttles exploded and things mm -hmm. like that. That all got defunded. Well, it was all going to get privatized eventually anyway. You can't say it wasn't. Yeah. Because well, and privatization of space has, has been wonderful. come back. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. And it's furthering the technology, so... Mm -hmm. Not just the space technology, but here, technology on Earth. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I mean... Ooh, stone tablet in the printing press. Oh, look at that. So it must be a book tablet. Aha! <laughs> Original map. A map. Aha! Double aha! Eureka! <laughs> wow! Oh, that was... So it wasn't a guillotine, it's a printing press. Interesting. Yeah. Man, that crystal thing, that's a Final Fantasy X, um... Enemy. It's pretty interesting. Which one? <laughs> uh, there, there are these crystals in the first area. At their later end, but they, their crystals spin actually around them instead of scattered all over the place. But I'm trying yeah. to remember that enemy, and it's been too long, I suppose. Oh, yes, Kitsune. I, I know. I agree. I see two things. Bowgun arrows. Yes, please. And a bowl or a saw blade. Disc. 
Oh, Kitsune, is it the end of the world? Yes. Triangular hallway. I feel like we've seen this area before. Scary. Locked and won't open. Okay, my bet is it's from the other side that we get to this. Oh, wow. Yep. You can see the wind moving leaves. Oh, you can. Look at that. Yeah, it's not very constant for the, the blow of the breeze, but it gives you a feel. Uh-oh. This could be bad. There's two doors and an item in the middle. And everyone will die. Ooh, oh, there's the relief the piece. Oh. oh, can't carry any more items. Poops. Dang it. Uh, wow, we only have one high potion. Let's use up something like dried food. Yes. And something like antidote. Uh, let's just go through and anything that we have very few of, well, not anything, but most things. Uh, because we've run out of inventory. That's so weird. No, now we know that there's a limit. Yay. Uh, bowgun arrows, that's fine. Uh, mask. Why do we have one of the masks? I don't know. Um, okay, I think we're good. That was a fun toy back in the 80s, the mask series. Yeah. Okay. Yes, let's pick it up. Now, I don't know where to go, because we now have three directions and no gating. Well, that clock puzzle probably is what that relief piece is for, isn't Right, it? right. We know that that's for that clock puzzle. But are we supposed to go this way or go back? Like I'd go back. I feel like we're here, so they want us to explore here. Stained uh, glass room. Mm -hmm. There are pieces missing. One, two, three, or we're missing one. Just one, though. That's pretty good. And what I'm seeing is, is that's the answer to the Greek puzzle. Which, isn't Greek just Latin? No. 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 The basis for Latin? It's, I know it's related. Yeah, Greek and Latin are slightly similar, but... Only slightly. Right. I mean, I mean, Greek, Latin, and uh, Spanish. All very similar. Romanian as well. Um, Romanian is actually the only living form of Latin that is spoken. Oh, wow. So, yeah, it's a pretty cool language. It's Art not the Latin. original Latin, though, if I were to guess. It's, it's slightly, I mean, it's developed over the thousands of years, slightly, right. but it's the only spoken form of it. Just well, like Espanol, oh, not Espanol, Spani Spanish is mm -hmm. very, it's far removed from Latin, but it's, it's bases. Well, it's so Latin. are French and Italian. They're rooted in Latin. Yep. Um, yep. That's, oh, and German. I, I always forget German because uh, English and German share some words. Okay, so this room opens that door, and now we have to go back. You were right, but I didn't want to go back without finding things out. Um, yeah, well, it works out. Wait, what? What? How did you do that? There's no save, save point here. That is stranger than did, strange can be. I break the game? I don't think so. Okay. No, maybe? I hope not. Please, no break the game. No, just oh. offer to save there. Wow, okay. I feel like... Either I glitched the game, or we're walking into a trap. And the game is like, well, we have to have a courtesy save here. That would be nice. It's being kind to us. Even though there's a save right over there. Huh. I think I'm we glitched the game. I'm wondering if when we solve this puzzle, it's going to be a boss battle in that room with the item in the center. That's possible. Eh. Let's see if this works. Please... By the power of the Dalek, you will work. Oh, yes, it does. Where did it open? Where did it open? Oh, God, it's going to explode. That opened that brick door. Wait, what? Why are we here? What is going on? Whoa. How did that do that? What? Okay. Oh, you've got to play the music sound. Oh, the music box. Okay, so I should walk back out. 
Yeah, and start over again. Because <clears throat> you have to play the song that the music box played when he walked into the room in the first place. Wait a minute. Okay, so that reset it. So... Oh, there's a symbol associated with it. Does that mean it's right? I don't know. But there are only so many combinations. That's true. What is there, like 16? Or... Yeah, it's pretty close. It's 4 factorial, so it's 1 times 2 times 3 times 4. So 1 times 2 is 2, 2 times 3 is 6, times 4 is 24. This is one of the only things I remembered from statistics. So that's how you pick out, you know, how many variations there are. You just go 1 times however many choices there mm -hmm. are. You just multiply through them, and you get, they go exponentially as you go. It's crappy. I hated statistics. I think I've played most of these now. Wow, that's weird. Okay, I'm going to leave and come back. Well, and we're assuming that the um, combination uses all four tones. It might not. It might double back on a tone or something like that. Oh, there it is. It does play it each time. Nope. I think I know it now. Nope, dang it. Why did she stop walking there? I got totally distracted by that fact. Okay, I need to listen to it again. No, stop pressing the buttons, Kudelka. <laughs> no, don't go down. Now she's just being difficult. Mm-hmm. No. <laughs> Hang on here. That's not right. Oh, this is this is starting to hurt me. No, you get it. Just listen to it a couple of times and I think you'll get it. No. This is tough. Uh, musical puzzles are not my gig. I feel like I have that backwards. I think it's supposed to be... Now I'm utterly confused. I think you almost have it right, though. I think it was your top, left, right, and then the bottom one. Maybe. Top, left, right. What if... That's, that's totally wrong. Hmm. This is definitely the last note. Right. Let me listen again. Because some of those notes sound so much alike, I, I think that's what the problem is. Yeah, I agree.
I thought I had it that time. Hmm. Uh, if we have to look this up, I don't care. What is this one? Is this still the archives? No, this is the puzzle behind the clock thing. In the library. Okay. Let me listen to this one more time. I might have it. I might understand it in my head. This is something that's frustrating, being someone who can play these notes. Like, right. if you gave me the instrument, I might better understand it. So, left, bottom... Yeah, I'm I'm stumped. I really don't want to sit here trying to figure out a music puzzle. <laughs> I did not sign up for that in this game. And like I said, several of those notes right, they sound the same. Let me see if I can. How long does this thing go for? Again. Hi, kids here. Aha! Got it. Right, left, up, down. Uh, oh, the music box broke, and we threw it away. Cool. Yay. That took an obstinate amount of time. Yeah, but you got it. Oh, 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 oh. What? What is that? Coffin. Just a mummy. Cross your fingers. That was disappointing. Yeah. Hi, savior. The secret of the Fomors from the bottom of the sea. Emigray. Wait a minute. I know Ooh. that man. The real Roger Bacon? Delicious bacon. Dead men just don't burst out you like that. Immigrate document? What do you know about the immigrate document? Where is it? Answer me. Immigrate document? Immigrate. Is that what you've been looking for? We found that. You crotchy old fart? Mm -hmm. Shadow hearts. I am sick of this. You don't want to talk? Fine. I'll slit your holy throat and leave your body for the rats. Edward. I have no choice. Here it is. I'm on instructions direct from the Vatican. There is a manuscript. It's said to be somewhere in the building. And that manuscript is... Right. It's called the Immigrate Document. Is it very important? For hundreds of years, it was kept deep inside the Vatican Library. No one was allowed to read it. In fact, many people thought it didn't even exist. That's weird. So why is it here now? Somebody stole it. Stolen? From the Vatican? Right. Here, here. No way. Not many people could steal a thing like that from the Vatican. 
You really have to know the place. Bacon. Have enough money. Uh -huh. Or his uh, protege. The wealthy gentleman who purchased this monastery bribed someone within the Vatican to steal the immigrate document for him. Wealthy gentleman? Yes. Patrick Hayworth. Maybe he's the man that tried to replace Bacon. It could but be. It's not like it was I'm starting to wonder. Something. Why would he be interested in a thing like that? For years, Patrick has dabbled in mysticism and alchemy. Yep. Yep. He's on the brink of crossing the line and playing God. Playing God? Creating life, Edward? It's thought that the ancient druids' forbidden secrets on eternal life and resurrecting the dead are contained in the Immigrate document. Uh -huh. I can't believe that. Of course, it's just silly superstition. That's why I'm here to try to convince Patrick to drop his dangerous experiments and return the Immigrate document to the Vatican. Wow. You'd never guess that a lunatic like that was living here by looking at the place. <laughs> oh, <laughs> Edward. He lives in the building next to the temple. They said that? Yes, they're terrified. With all the crazy things going on around here now, they haven't even seen Patrick, yet they feel indebted to him. They've asked me here to see if I can save him. So that's your story? I don't know. One more mystery that needs unraveling. Here, here. Uh, hmm. Interesting. That's really weird. Um, having played Shadow Hearts first, and then we just like know these things. Oh, there it is. Cool. But yeah, like knowing these things that we shouldn't know. Right. Um, right. And tying the pieces together backwards. <laughs> it's kind of cool. I like it. I I do, but it's it's still quite odd. Yeah, I've seen reverse time, basically. Yep. Um, and off the clock. That was definitely Roger Bacon, though. Um, the yeah. real Roger Bacon. Um, so at this point, he's already a zombie. I remember wondering about him because he didn't look quite right in Shadow Hearts. Right, right. Uh, now apparently we have more pieces to the Roger Bacon puzzle and See. to his apprentice. Mm-hmm, exactly. Huh. Wait a minute, this isn't the right way. Uh, so, I want to try to solve that puzzle before we go on. I don't want to leave an unfinished puzzle and then go to the next disc, because I know that's what's going to happen. Uh, it's been long enough in the game at this point. Yeah. Well, I think that next puzzle will lead us to the next disc. She just did 1,500 damage. Guess she's a badass. In lingerie. Basically. Yep. I mean, if you're going to show off your underwear and you got those, like, fancy lattice things on your boobs, it, it's basically lingerie. <laughs> what, what is uh, the word I'm looking for? Um, it's not lattice. It's, uh... Um, oh, you know, I'm blanking on it, too. Frill. It's not frill. That's not the word, either. It's God not dang. fringe, either. It's, Maybe uh, it's fringe. Uh, man, I can't think of it either. But it's almost lace. like a negligee. It's a lace. Lace, kind of yeah. Thing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, that's what it is. It's lace. Alright. Oh, that's right. The wall was broken before, wasn't it? Yep. Um, okay. The printing press is on, on this side, so I don't know how it did that. But I'm not going to question it. I just I want to understand things just slightly better, I guess. Yeah. I just want to save. Um, saving, saving. I actually want to wrap up here so I can take a restroom break before <laughs> we continue on. All right. Restroom uh, break. Plus, I got to give a little suspense. I mean, after all that, we've got like three things that we need to do. We're going to yes. open that door, we're going to solve that puzzle, and then we've got a boss that ends the disc. So See? that's going to be fun, that's going to be interesting. I hope you've all enjoyed this episode. I know we have. Yeah, here's your cliffhanger. Ha, 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 ha. <laughs> Bye, everybody. Bye.